Hi guys, it's me today with some more Minecraft Faction Adventures and I had to start recording it as soon as I could. I've just I literally have just found this hole in this base and they've got absolutely loads of blazes. But I thought I need to get straight into the recording because there's no one on, I don't think, from the faction. Because at first we were gonna try it inside and then we found out that actually we can just go straight into this base. But um I think we're gonna try and get all the blazes because it seems quite easy to get at the moment. And we're hoping we can get nearly all of these blazes, which would be absolutely mad. I wanted to do a bit of a cannon raid, but it seems like things have changed very quickly and it's become a very, very fast raid and straight into getting, uh, what's it called, um, just trying to get the blazes. I just thought I'd show you guys, I wanted you guys to see it all. I'm hoping no one's going to turn up because that would be absolutely crazy. Then we've got to start PvPing, but I think someone might be in the faction and we're trying to get him... Um, to come and just mine up for us. Um, F, F. Yeah, I've got a, I've got a silk touch, so if they need me to do it, as you can see, it is on the faction raids, so that is really good. But we're just hoping that none of their uh, members come on, so which is sort of the, that's why we're trying to get it done quickly. I may be able to go down here. I think that's where Dark went. I can't tell. Uh, maybe um, I'm not sure what he's doing down there. I think he's working his way back up. I think, it's, I think that's what he's doing. So I think we're gonna try and get some of these blazes. But I just want to thank you guys for all the support you have been given the channel. It is absolutely awesome. But I couldn't do any of the thank yous yet. I was just trying to get us straight into the raid. I think Dark is gonna try and just check in if they. He might be able to do an unclaim. Um, but yeah, we just wanted to, I wanted to show you guys this as soon as I could because it is an absolutely awesome raid. Do I need to give him stuff? I can't remember. Oh, he can place. That is crazy. That's, oh, where is he? Oh my god, where is he going? He's just building. Oh, okay, that's why guys, he's got his godset on, that's why he's, he's going like this. I think he's trying to get rid of all the water at the moment. So, and then it means we were able to um, get all of these, which would be absolutely crazy. So it's a bit of an inside, a bit not of an inside, it's really weird, but I'm hoping this is going to work. Um, I think he's the, can you see me? Uh, hello? I think he's going to, okay, here you go. There you go. There you go, hopefully he's going to be able to get all of these drop out and then we're going to be able to get through all the base and this is going to be absolutely awesome because I tell you what guys, we need as many blades as we can at the moment and this should be absolutely awesome. We're going to hopefully get as many as we can. Here we go. Da -da 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 -da. This seems a very, very simple raid, just getting as much as we can and I tell you what, I don't think we've done a, a raid like this. I definitely think it's more of an inside because the guy is mining it for us, but you know what? I'll take. Oh no! Oh god, we are gonna have to have a quick reboot. Hopefully, we can get all the stuff first, and then that would be absolutely awesome because we do need to get all of it. Because I believe there is cows as well in this base and uh, some pig spawners, so I definitely will take all of that. And then hopefully, this guy's gonna be able to get them all and pass it to us. Hopefully, give it back to me. Can hopefully, he'll be able to give me my silk back. Uh, silk. <laughs> the guy's gonna split the base for us. Nice. Okay, so after the reboot, I will be back for you guys, and we are hopefully gonna get all this stuff out of the base. We are back on, guys, so hopefully now we are gonna be able to get all these other spawners I believe he is just gonna go through and get as many spawners as we can I can't help with them keep making us go like this but it's just just what happens because he has got I believe he's got a god set on hasn't he yeah I think he has uh, let's get speed back I'm hoping we're gonna get some nice stuff I don't think they've got anything protection we'll take that might as well take all of this stuff because we 
have got free passage to all of this. Anything any good? Not really. Um, shadow steps not bad. Um, I don't think there's anything any good here, but I just thought you guys need to see a good raid for once, and I thought you guys deserved it. And I'm so I'm not a big fan of inside, but I tell you what, guys, I do have to admit I was quite happy to find these guys because. They were getting a bit annoying in Warzone, so I was happy we were able to get it all. And I think now we're going to be able to get the, um, get some cow spawners as well, which is awesome. And uh, the guy who's helping us, I believe, is uh, going to be joining our faction, so that is awesome. Oh, there is a guy online. That's the only issue. We need to probably get in and out very quickly. PV2, maybe. I think I'm going to chuck some of chuck some stuff in here because I do know can't help with this the effect guys I think it's just all it is hoping he's gonna get all the stuff and then we can get out nice and quickly but I don't think there's anything else here for us but I tell you what a nice quick raid um, make sure no one's come too close no nope. cool so hopefully this is gonna end awesomely well and we are going to be able to get all of the spawners which I think we are going to be able to do a bit of a weird start to the episode and I wanted to get you guys some good raids and I wasn't able to but I have found about two more and both of them are very rich raids so hopefully it will end very well. This guy's gonna give my stuff back. Uh, I'm gonna give it back. Hopefully. And then we can head off because I think that is absolutely crazy. Uh, this guy gonna give me a silk touch back because I sort of need it. Please give me a silk touch back. What's this? Silence. I'm a bit bored. Hoping he's gonna give us our stuff back. Oh, the suspense. I'm so confused. <laughs> Trading dark or how that is. Just doing trades back and forth. Um, nice pigs, is that it? Pigs? 8 cows and 21 blazes. That is absolutely crazy. I can't believe we've got all that. I don't think they're trading me, I wonder. No, don't want to trade me, but I need my silk touch. Um, can we get silk back, please? I do need my silk touch, and I think we're just going to blow up the whole base. Oh, thank you. There we go, guys. That is an absolutely awesome raid. I think we're going to blow up this whole base now. But yes, we've got 21 blazes from that. The blaze grinder should be going up very soon, I believe. But that will be absolutely awesome. I can't wait for that to happen. And hopefully, this is all going to finish off on a very nice raid but yeah I don't think there's anything else here um, I think they went through all this stuff and it was empty I think we got the god chest because we found all those runes so that is awesome I wasn't going to go anywhere anyway yeah a, a very successful raid I tell you what guys 21 blazes you No, I'm not up for PvP at the moment, guys. I'm still working on my god set, because as you guys know, I'm rubbish at making god sets. But we got this base. Um, it was a bit like a tip-off from one of our truces, which is absolutely awesome. They sent me some coordinates. So, you know what? I'll go and try and find them. And it seems to have worked very, very well. And it seems to have led out to a very, very successful raid. An absolutely awesome spawner raid. And I'm so happy that happened. Um, I've always wanted to try and get some good raids in for you guys and the next couple of episodes hopefully they will be some very rich raids but I'm going to try and get some more PvP done on the channel if that's in factions or it may be in um, what's it called uh, Sky Wars just trying out some other things for you guys see if you guys enjoy it and please let me know if you do enjoy other episodes as well but I think we're just going to blow this all up this is absolutely mad <laughs> this guy really wants to blow it up uh, I don't think I showed you guys a might of, but if, if you can see up there, see if we can get up there. Nope. 
uh, just where my uh, point is, it's in this corner here, so hard to show you, but just just over there, in that corner there, the um, some guys forgot to uh, cover up a block, and when I did my wall download, the I realised it and thought, you know what, this actually might get us in, and it led us straight into the blades, because I thought it was absolutely mad, so that would be absolutely awesome, if you guys can hit a like button bit of an inside raid, a bit of a normal raid, but we'll go with an inside raid because the guys helped us get absolutely everything. Uh, I think it's about 35 spawners, uh, 150, 150, 21 blazes for about, they're about 150k each, which is absolutely crazy, so that is awesome. I think we're going to now blow up the whole base with TNT, so I'm just going to have to see how this goes, but this guy seems to be really into his blowing stuff up. God, it's crazy. I don't think I might. I don't think I'll survive this. This is interesting. I think I'm gonna try and put my stuff here, just in case. I just... Oh, okay, he's digging us away out. See, this guy is good. I like him in our faction. He seems very good. We were gonna raid in through here, so that was quite sick. But I think we're gonna just wait here and. Oh my God! Base rip. So yeah. That's what happens when you get insided and <laughs> or overclaimed. But this is when after we get an insider helping us out. And I did want to do an inside raid because it's a bit of a different type of raid. So that is absolutely awesome. Um, yeah, I'm I'm quite speechless, guys. It happened straight out of nowhere. Um, we really didn't expect this to happen. I found the hole. Dark was able to get this guy to um, come and. Uh, inside for us because the guy then let him back in the factions so that is absolutely mad so hopefully it all ended well and we got lots of blazes out there and we've been trying to get a good blaze grinder going and 21 blazes is absolutely mad so hopefully we'll be able to use that xp or make money from it in the future and come up with some more absolutely awesome raids but i tell you what guys that is absolutely crazy and an awesome way to finish the episode off and i know it'll be a bit of a short episode but i wanted to get you guys a good raid and show you some of the stuff you can get from raids. But yeah, guys, I'm so speechless. I did not expect this to happen. I've got two more raids um, coming up in hand. I don't want to say anything yet, but they are very, very rich. I think they are both in the top 10 of F top. Both got over 6 mil of spawners. It's absolutely crazy. And me, Darko, and the Vanguard faction want to try and get through all of them and hopefully make a good amount of money very, very soon. But I'm just going to see if there's anyone from... Okay, I think they're going to try and gank the guy who owns it or is a mod because I think the guy is, is going to Collins and he's been calling, causing us some problems at certain raids. So, for once, guys, we've been able to get back at this guy. But I, I think we got, what did we get? That's Max Rune. That's, these are, that is. That's not, uh, that, that's Max. This is crazy. So that's two Max Rune or Protection Rune. Uh, PV2, I think it is. Um. That is an. I think these were all to boost up. That's maxed. Uh, that's just blessed. So it looks like we've got a couple of. Three max runes there, which is quite. That's just crazy. I didn't expect to get that. So, health boost 3, flame element to 10, and wolves 8, and a protection rune, all from that raid. I tell you what, that is not bad. I'm so happy I found that chest because that's got a lot of runes in. But yeah, thank you guys for all the support you've given the channel. Uh, I know this raid was very sudden, very quick. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, let's see if we can hit that 10 likes again. You guys are awesome at the moment. That is reporting. Okay. But all the support you've been given the faction channel, uh, sorry, series, and all the support you've been given the channel is absolutely awesome. Thank you so much. Let's even get to that 100 subscribers very, very soon. We are so close to it. And all your support has been very thankful, guys. So I'll see you all in the next episode. See ya. A few moments later. Just before you guys thought the episode was finished, I just thought I'd give you some facts. At the moment, the guy is going nuts in chat, and I didn't realise he thought those runes I showed you, you know, the max runes, uh, I'll show you guys now, uh, these ones, he said he thought they blew them up, or he thought we'd blew them up, and actually we've actually got them, which is absolutely crazy, and we just, or I've just found out, F-Top 2, they were worth 12 mil. And okay, they were. Wait, how's this faction worse? Uh, okay, that's changed. They had a lot of stuff. They had um, 
12 mil spawner value and we have just taken it all they've just got some guy to join the fact for some reason with loads of money but um they were 12 mil so that was a 12 mil f top raid which was absolutely crazy and as you can see the guy in chat the moment is trying to fight dark orcs it's causing it calling us randies which is absolutely funny because this is what happens every time you raid someone but yeah he seems to be very mad at the moment but i just thought i'd show you guys this as i thought it was quite funny to see how mad they get and their allies i think legendary who i said that we may be coming for very very soon are very annoyed at us as well so i tell you what if we can get that raid done as well that will be absolutely awesome and they can try and defend it but dark at the moment has got some very very good cannons and not many walls can stop it so hopefully we'll be able to get to them very very soon and hopefully that'll be it for the next couple of episodes and i can see darko there is trying to find this guy because he wants to 1v1 darko which i thought is absolutely hilarious so i'll see you guys in the next episode i just wanted to show you guys that because it's absolutely hilarious so i'll see you guys all in the next episode see ya